How's it going, guys? This is gonna be kind of like an up church reaction video. He's got his new song out. He teamed up with Colt Ford, and it's called Shoulda Named It After Me. I'm gonna tell you right now, it's pretty badass. Um, he said in 2000, he promised, he basically promised his fans that 2018 was gonna be a different year. It was gonna be a badass year. I'm gonna tell you right now. With, with this, yeah, it's going to be a fucking year to remember. Now, as for my channel, like, this is badass. Now, for me personally, in 2018, I have big plans for my channel. Um, seriously, I got some huge ideas. And on top of that, uh, I'm I'm gunning for the best that I can do in 2018. 2017, I sat around too much. 2018, it's about time I take the bull by the horns. It's about time I ride the Diablo. So, that being said, up church, just grab the bull by its horns and put it through the fucking roof of the church. Like, listen to that. Like, he fucking killed it. Like, I've... Hit some of his songs, you know, they're not the best. We all vibe with different stuff. But I'm gonna tell you right now, Radio Jam was a fucking amazing hit. Rolling Stoned was a perfect hit. This right here, this is gonna... Hands down that 2018 is in trouble of this dude. This dude is going to just destroy 2018 record labels. This dude don't sign to record labels. I'm gonna tell you right now. The 2018 is in serious trouble of Upchurch, the frigging redneck. That and like I was never much of a fan of Colt Ford but you know it is what it is Colt Ford killed it in that verse and to be frigging honest I never even really knew Up Church until like three years ago because the first thing I heard from Up Church was Outlaw with I believe Luke Combs was it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. And that was because my brother showed me that song. And ever since then, I've just been listening to Upchurch because, well, he's got songs that I can vibe to. And there's been countless occasions where I'm stuck in my truck alone thinking to myself, just trying to reevaluate life as a young adult or young individual in general. And... I just turn on one of his songs on my phone and put it through the Bluetooth and just, he helps me just grasp life. And with this song right here, I started to think 2018 was slipping away, but nah. If he can grab it, if he can grab 2018 and fucking ride it like a jockey, I think I can do the fucking same. Like, the, he killed it with this. I cannot wait to hear the rest of this fucking album. You can best bet after this video is uploaded, I'm going on iTunes and I'm checking every one of them songs out. Like, this is insane. He fucking dominated. So, this is pretty much just a uh, little reaction video of Up Church and the new song, Shoulda Named It After Me. So, I hope you all enjoyed. As always, stay minty, keep it friggin' retarded. And yeah, that was pretty friggin' badass. This guy, uh, he's got talent. He's got talent on top of talent with a side of motherfucking talent. So...
don't worry, next video that's coming up is going to be me reviewing the Grizzly Dark Select. And then a video after this is probably going to be my Jeep video that I did for you all, which is pretty boring, but go watch it. Maybe you'll enjoy. I want to hear you guys' opinions on what you want me to do with it. So anyways, before this gets too long, hope you all enjoyed. Stay minty. Keep it retarded. And up church, you're the fucking man.